Okay, let's go ahead and get started. We'll first need to download the software, go to poweradmin.com, navigate to the file site page, and download File Site Ultra. From here, we'll want to run the install, so just follow along with the setup wizard until the installation is complete. Once the installation is finished, in the next screen, you'll want to leave the defaults checked and click Finish. Once you've done this, you'll notice another pop-up that's showing the service is starting. Now just follow along with the file site startup wizard until we get to the email configuration process. From here, we'll want to configure email so we're able to receive email notifications. So you'll want to enter your email address, enter your SMTP server name, your password, enter your port number, set the encryption level to don't know, and then hit the test button. Once FileSite has completed testing the primary server, hit OK, and you'll also notice that it's automatically changed the encryption level to the appropriate setting. Now click OK, and you'll be prompted to configure the log file. You'll create the first FileSite monitor. Here you'll want to enter the path of the folder that you wish to monitor or audit. Once you click OK, PA FileSite will now take control of the mouse and will create the new monitor for you. You can follow along and watch as it creates this new monitor. You'll notice that it will enter the path for you in the directory to monitor. Now click OK. For our test and configuration, we'll want to get alerts when someone reads or writes to any files in the folder that we had chosen previously. From here, We'll also go to the action section and we'll set up how we're going to be notified. Let's add a message box and an email action to the monitor. This is how we'll get notified when someone reads or writes to your confidential files. After a few moments, PA file site will refresh so you're able to see the two monitors that you've set up. Now that we're all set up, Let's test file site to see it in action. Go to the folder that you've set up to monitor and open a file within that folder. A few moments after opening the confidential file, you'll notice that a pop-up message box is going to show alerting you that the file is being read. Now let's make a change to the file. Save it and we'll test out the monitor that we set up to alert us to any file changes. A few moments later, you'll get another message box alert that's going to show you the changed file, who wrote to it, and the computer that it was changed from. Now let's run a quick report to see what has happened today. Click the Generate button and FileSite will create a report for you that will show you all of the reads and writes to the monitored files. Finally, let's check our email for alerts. You'll see we now have email alerts sent to us 
showing all of the file reads and file writes in the monitor directories. For more information about any of our monitoring products, please visit us at www.poweradmin.com.